हेलो नमस्कार एंड वेलकम टू सिक्किम क्रॉनिकल र सिक्किम क्रॉनिकल को आज को यस एडिशन में हमी कुरा कानी गर्न लागि रहे का सों फिल्म्स मूवीज अनि फूड लाई ले रहा अनि तो फिर को परिचय मगरन लागि रहे कुछ एंड एक्टर पार एक्सेलेंस हजुर धेरै वटा मुभीमा तपाईले उहाँलाई देखि सक्नु भएको छ यस अफ कोर्स बलिवुड मुभीजमा त देख्नु भएको छ भने तपाईले इंग्लिश मुभीजमा पनि उहाँलाई देखि सक्नु भएको छ उहाँ सिक्किम आउनुहुन्छ अनि यो पाली युवा जुन सिक्किम आउनु भएको छ उहाँको एउटा स्पेशल मिशन छ अनि त्यो मिशन चाहिँ के हो भने सेप्टेम्बर इलेभेन्थ मा यस ही विल बी कुकिङ एन्ड फिडिङ द पिपल अफ सिक्किम लेडिज एन्ड जेन्टलमेन माइ प्लेजर टु इन्ट्रोड्युस एन एक्टर फॉर एक्सिलेन्स मिस्टर आदिल हुसैन नमस्कार नमस्कार क्या हाल है आपका बढ़िया है आप कैसे लेकिन आपने जो नेपाली में बताया वो मेरे बारे में खराब चीजें बताया अच्छी चीजें बताई है बताओ बहुत बहुत अच्छी अच्छी चीजें बताई है मुझे समझ में आता है लेकिन सो आप खराब चीजें बताने से मुझे पता चल जाएगा कि मेरे बारे में खराब चीजें बता रहे हो नहीं नहीं बहुत अच्छी अच्छी बातें कही है मैंने सो आई जस्ट वॉन्टेड टू नो कि ये आपकी पहली विजिट है क्या सिक्किम में नहीं ये मेरी दूसरी है और लेकिन एक किस्म से पहले है क्योंकि पहले पहले बार जब मैं यहाँ आया था आई वॉज शूटिंग ए फिल्म आई डेंट गेट टाइम टू लुक अराउंड एंड मूव अराउंड मच और ये दूसरी बार है जो मेरे ख्याल से मैं दस दिन रहूंगा सिर्फ गैंग टॉक के और सिक्किम के अलग अलग जगह को देखने के लिए यस और मेरे रिसर्च ये बताता है कि आदिल हुसैन जी का दो चीज पे पैशन है एक तो एक्टिंग और दूसरा कुकिंग सो so, स्पेसिफिकली मेरे सोर्सेस ने बताया कि आप कुछ पकाने वाले हैं यहाँ पे <laughs> जी जी बिल्कुल मैं पकाने वाला हूँ और 11 ग्यारा, सितंबर में सितंबर को मुकिमची रेस्टोरेंट में लंच हम करेंगे और मैं खुद आठ डिशेस बनाऊंगा नौ डिशेस एक्चुअली उसमें से आलू तिल को अचार भी होंगे सिक्किम के और बाकी जो डिशेस होंगे वो कश्मीर से होंगे केरला से होंगे असम से होंगे बंगाल से होंगे और मेरे पर्सनल कुछ रेसिपीज हैं वो भी मैं बनाऊंगा और एक बहुत ही चीज है वो है मे, मेरे हाथ से बना हुआ पिछले आठ साल से मैं बना रहा हूँ एक चटनी अचार उसमें किंग चिली है भूत जुलुकिया बेम्बू शूट एंड मास्टर्ड मिला करके एक चटनी वो भी जाएगा इस पर्टिकुलर फीस्ट के साथ और आ, मेरे साथ होंगे सुशेफ करेंगे सुगम एंड आशिकी और आ, नितेश जो हमारे मुकिम जी की ओनर हैं ही विल बी आल्सो सुपरवाइजिंग मी आई होप दैट आई कीप अप द स्टैंडर्ड ऑफ द वंडरफुल कोरियन रेस्टोरेंट एंड पैन एशियन कुजीन जिस जहाँ मिलता है मुकिमची में आप बहुत निर्दय हो मुंह में पानी डाल देते हो मतलब <laughs> आ, मतलब व्हाट इज योर पैशन फॉर हाउ कम लाइक यू नो इतना आप लोगों के दिल में अपने एक्टिंग के थ्रू तो जगह बना चुके हैं अब आप फूड के थ्रू बनाना चाहते हैं हाँ ये मेरा प्रैक्टिस हो गया था क्योंकि मेरी बीवी जो है अभी जब मेरी वो गर्लफ्रेंड था थी <laughs> उसको वो कहते हैं ना कि आ, पेट के जरिए दिल तक पहुंचना तो मैंने उनकी पेट के जरिए आई रीच आउट टू हर हार्ट आई टू कुक फॉर हर एवरी डे वेन वी आर डेटिंग एंड नाउ शी इज माई वाइफ फॉर लास्ट थर्टीन ईयर्स वी आर मैरिड हैप्पीली मैरिड एंड फॉर ट्वेंटी ईयर्स वी हैव सेवन ईयर्स आई हैव टू फीड हर टू बिकम माई वाइफ सो आई थिंक कुकिंग इज अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट थिंग फॉर मी टू रीच आउट टू पीपल्स हार्ट थ्रू द स्टमक एंड आई थिंक इट इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट ऑल्सो फिलोसॉफिकली स्पीकिंग नो एक्चुअली बायोलॉजिकली स्पीकिंग जब मैं खाना बनाता हूँ तो खाना खाने के बाद उस खाने के अंदर जितने सारे मिनरल्स है विटामिन है वो आपके शरीर में जाता है आपका मांसपेशी आपके आंखों में आपके दिमाग में जाता है सांस जो है सॉफ्टवेयर को आ, फ्यूल देता है और फूड है हार्डवेयर का फ्यूल सो so, आप मैं, मैं आपका शरीर का हिस्सा बन जाता हूं yes. तो इसलिए खाना बनाने का जो पैशन है वो भी आहिस्ता आहिस्ता चेंज होने लगा है अभी किस मूड में मैं रहता हूं और रहने आ, अच्छे मूड में रहने के लिए मुझे मजबूर करता है खाना बनाना ताकि आपके लिए जो मैं खाना बनाऊंगा वो आपको खा के अच्छा लगे वो एनर्जी उसके अंदर जाए yes. आपकी फेवरेट लाइक यू नो डिशेस कौन कौन सी है बहुत सारे हैं क्योंकि पूरे दुनिया में घूम चुका हूं तो एक चीज जैसे सिक्किम बहुत सुंदर जगह है और गोवा भी सुंदर है और कश्मीर भी सुंदर है और स्विट्जरलैंड भी सुंदर है तो एक चीज तो नहीं हो सकता है ना कोई भी चीज मेरी सबसे फेवरेट लेकिन बचपन से जो मैं खा के आया हूँ सत्रह साल के उम्र तक सत्ताईस साल की उम्र तक मैं आसाम में था और जो मेरे लिए माँ पहली दफा बनाया था वो ज्यादा 
पसंद आता है हमेशा सिंपल फूड जो है हाँ सिंपल फूड जो है जो दाल है चावल है निंगरो है वो हम, हमारे असम में भी बहुत खाया जाता है प्रॉन्स है फिश है आलू भरता सिंपल फूड मुझे बहुत पसंद है सो कैन वी सी इन फ्यूचर आदिल कमिंग ऑफ इट इज ओन रेस्टोरेंट जॉइंट <laughs> नहीं मेरे पास समय अगर होता तो मैं कर लेता मैंने सोचा भी था एक तो अचार जो है मैं वो मार, मार्केट करने के लिए सोच रहा हूँ वो अभी तक नहीं हो पाया क्योंकि समय बिल्कुल कम मिलता है लेकिन मेरे ख्याल से फिल्म में करना मैं अगले दो तीन साल के बाद शायद कम कर दूंगा उसके बाद शायद मैं रेस्टोरेंट तो नहीं कर सकता हूँ वो मेरे बस की बात नहीं है Uh, क्योंकि उसके लिए बहुत एनर्जी चाहिए बहुत ही समय भी चाहिए और धीरज चाहिए धीर धैर्य चाहिए तो मेरे अंदर है नहीं लेकिन लोगों के रेस्टोरेंट में जाके खाना बनाऊंगा वो मेरा जो पैशन है वो भी फुलफिल होएगा और मुझे इतना रेस्पॉन्सिबिलिटी नहीं भी लेना पड़ेगा सर <laughs> yes, uh, गोलपारा आसाम से एक बंदा निकलता है बहुत टेंडर और यंग एज में सपने लिए और uh, अपना ड्रीम को चेस करता है फिर वो थिएटर करता है फिर मूवी में आता है नॉट ओनली इन इंडिया नाउ यू आर क्रिटिकली एक्लेम्ड इन एन इंटरनेशनल मूवीज आई एम श्योर अभी आकर लोग आपको देखते हैं सक्सेसफुल देखते हैं ताली बजाते हैं अच्छी अच्छी बातें करते हैं लेकिन आपका अपना ही जर्नी रहा है वॉज द जर्नी इजी फॉर यू आई थिंक एनी जर्नी विच इज इजी इज नॉट वर्थ इट you know journey should be difficult and then when you reach a destination it feels good like if you climb a mountain because of the difficulties of the climber makes the climbing worthwhile right. when you reach the summit there is nobody waiting for you with a garland there but the process of climbing itself is joyous and that is called the intrinsic joy yes. in the act of doing itself mm. so my journey to whatever people see now me as adil whatever you know acting in indian films hollywood films and all that those are the tip of the iceberg right. the foundation is the theater work that i did is the hard work i put in in the to learn the craft of acting those are and those were also the most pleasurable work because i learned so much i was joyous i was happy i was um, overwhelmed i was enchanted and then slowly i started doing films so when i did theater probably theater is my most you know favorite place to act in front of in front of the camera it's okay i like it but i love the- doing theater more right sir uh, when it comes to like you know the representation of original cinema like mm. you are an actor who knows your craft so well right and you meticulously choose your projects right mm. but when we talk about the original cinema in specific to north east region how do you see the growth where it is heading i think the north east can do way better yeah. i think that the film industry is in the north east very almost negligent it's almost not there Assam had been in the forefront in terms of like how many films are being made per year uh and the first film was made in 1935 in Assam in spite of that still i feel the industry could grow at least 100 fold yes. if not 1000 fold yes. and for that i think the governments of the northeastern states could probably take more initiative funding the film institutes like sikkim should have a film institute or dra- drama institute assam should have a film is- it has one but it can be bigger it can be more uh, of international standard meghalaya and mizoram and nagaland amazing talent is filled in this particular if i uh, as as you said guy from gwalpara when newspaper is to come 3 days after it published mm. if i can go and acting a hollywood series like star trek anybody can do it yes if i can do it anybody can do it i am an ordinary guy from a ordinary place yes. but i had the passion yes passion is must love for the craft is must also if those people are facilitated by the society yes. facilitated by their parents by the schools and education system and the government especially the governments because they must spend way more money in art and culture True. art and culture includes food also by the way because it's a part of culture yes. and food is one of the most beautiful ways as i said before to get into somebody's heart and art for example films and uh, and 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 handicraft and 
you know uh, dance and music and all that so government should start spending more money on art and culture because through art and culture we can bring people together yes and 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 make people happy and happy people don't fight yes we can spend less money on law and order and more money if we spend more money on art and culture yes that's my so, view. So when we talk about the representation of an artist from Northeast yes. in the mainstream cinema, uh, we can name it like Sima Biswas, yes. uh, uh, Adil, Danny uh, Danjungpa, Gitanjali, whom you have worked both of them in yes. Bioscope Wala. When it comes to the representation, do you think like the identity has been misunderstood in the mainstream cinema? I think so. I think uh, misunderstood. Uh, and the responsibility lies on all of us. Yes. You know, I'm not saying that responsibility lies only in Bollywood or people, those who make Hindi films. Like, for example, I didn't know, someone just told me right now, I was giving an, another interview, that there are uh, 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 certain schemes of Sikkim government of giving subsidies to the filmmakers. Uh, filmmakers. Yes. I didn't know. Mm. Why I don't know about it? Mm. I'm from here. I didn't know. That means it is important to talk about it more now I know so now I will talk about it you know in fact it is important that uh, so identity in terms of identity for example when they made a film called Maricom I desperately wanted the director the producer to cast someone from Northeast okay. yes Priyanka Chopra did a fantastic job and she is an ad amazing actor and she is doing very well I all my love and admiration for her but if the director and producer would have cast a person from northeast then the faces of the northeast the culture of the northeast would have been introduced to the mass consciousness of the indian uh, population mm. then they would not look at us people from the northeast oh they are from outside somewhere mm -hmm. so that responsibility lies also in the mainstream film industries like tamil and bombay and you know and uh, malayalam film industries as well and also us why aren't we doing enough as well yes. why there are no uh, proper support from the entire uh, you know governments of the northeastern country to lift the art and culture of india uh, of the northeast towards the world we can make more films here and great films we hire good directors from the northeast and make films support them uh, do them uh, make them do workshops and showcase our way of life and culture and food to the world it is right, important right, absolutely so do you think like you know i mean uh, people whom you uh, like you who are leading in the cinema from the northeast region should come up with a forum which in fact gives more uh, impetus in the policy in regard to uh, cinema making or for the filmmakers or for an artist especially from the northeastern region artists like you and others yes i think uh, definitely that initiative can be taken uh, but also it is important to see don't forget that i am just an actor i'm not a producer and a director yes as an actor i also depend on people to cast me yes. so i am not in a powerful position yes i am in a powerful position because people know me if i tell somebody an actor a producer a director let's shoot a film in sikkim mm. and i have moved one film which was supposed to be shot in kerala i made them shoot in assam mm. i made the character not a malayali but an assamese character i played the lead in that film called nirvana in so i i have that much power so i can do that but the initiation has to be taken from here from your state that okay let's let's invite adil let's invite danny dangjongpa let's invite gitanjali thapa make them meet here let's talk about policies let's talk about what all we can do in the future we that that initiative should come from here yes so uh, you have worked with uh, internationally acclaimed director like Ang Lee mm -hmm. and like Meera Nair Correct. and on the other hand you have worked in commercial flicks like Good News and Bell Button. Right. So I mean this balance of like you know balancing act of like you know when it comes to commercial cinema and art cinema how do you find this thin line being like distinguished? <laughs> well it is a thin line and I think a very simple answer to that is that I play roles. So when I act in bell films like Bell Bottom or uh, or Good News or Force 2 or Robo 2, I play the role of an actor who acts in those films. Mm. 
and when i uh, play a role in a film like i recently did a khasi film mm. called uh, um uh, flenor lorni lorni means the one who pokes his nose around everywhere yeah, yeah. Uh, and that film the budget of that film was very very less very shoestring budget, uh, shoestring yeah. budget and uh, that film opened in one of the most prestigious festivals in the west it's called black nights uh, festival in estonia yes you know so uh, i play the role of a person of an actor who acts in a, s- in a sh- small budget film so there are uh, films like big budget film there is like s- uh, small budget film there is love budget and there are no budget films you know like for example life of pi is budget is 110 million dollar yes. say bell bottom budget is say 50 crore and then uh, the film that i just finished right now shooting in bombay is maybe so 5 crore 6 crore and then the khasi film could be around like say not even 50 lakhs mm-hmm. you know so then i play the role of an actor who acts in these kind of films is very simple so after me. msd when you like you know uh, tried coming in films way back uh, did you kind of like you know face difficulties in terms of racism because uh, this has been a subject of discussion in national media even yes. like you know the people from north eastern are treated as a second class citizen in the mainstream indias mm-hmm. what is your point of view on this well i i have never faced anything never even i do, i don't know about uh, danny ji's uh, what he has to say about it you should ask him uh, but i personally feel that racism is uh, not only toward people from the north east like i have in fact faced in a way that when i go to south india oh ye this is this guy ye north india se hai yeah. south indian people those who come to north india is ye to madrasi hai <laughs> and then people from north east when they go to uh, rest of the india they are oh, these are from nor- uh, north eastern people or people those who come from outside to north india i don't know you tell me do they face any racism you know so oh ye delhi wala hai ye assam ka hai so we uh, i think inherently human beings are territorial you know we have an instinct called the dog instinct we all have it like oh this is from uh, this area of gangtok that's from oh he's from territory that part of territorial division. division we all have it Yes. it is our responsibility when i say our i mean people those who practice art their responsibility to to let go of these divisions to blur this territorial instinct to get out of the animal instinct of oh this is my place you come from outside i think world is changing now you know we have to welcome people we also have to feel earn the welcome of the other Yes absolutely you know so that's our job as a human being to grow and evolve so there are so many aspiring aspiring actors from this region who wants Correct. to go to mumbai and experiment like with their like you know i mean acting skills yes. what is your advice to them i think first of all to find out that whether they really love what they do yes it is very important because it's a hard hard life out there unless you love something you will not be able to stick around you will then realize that oh this is not what i really want to do because when to learn anything and to go deeper into it you have to do a lot of hard work you have no idea how hard it is to do that hard work if you love it then it is easier for you to cross those hurdles if you are infatuated if you have a crush for a woman for a girl then that girl will give you hard time you say oh i don't want to be with you but if you love someone you will stick around like a like a mother sticks around with her child you know that mu- that kind of love if you have unconditional you might not get anything back from what you love and success doesn't come overnight there not at all it might not come at all till you die but you have to still be happy you will be still be happy if you love it if you do something which you love and you don't get recognition you don't get money out of it you, you will still be happy because you are doing what you love to do So what is your message to the entire like you know all the viewers who are watching you right now Well I don't know I I think that to find out what uh, you love to do and uh, I love to cook as well I don't know whether I love cooking more than I act because my acting teacher once said that I don't know whether you are a better cook than an actor <laughs> so that was a bit f- i felt like mm, my acting teacher is criticizing me so i think it is important to find 
uh, what you love to do cast yourself in the right roles in life and come to uh, mukimchi on the 11th of september and eat the food i will make it with a lot of love yes i want you to make an invitation in a local language okay. and uh, i will help you out okay. uh, to invite the audience uh, yes. namaskar namaskar hajir haru hajir haru september 11 tarik सेप्टेम्बर एगारो तारीख मुकिमची रेस्टुरेट में मुकिमची रेस्टुरेट में आला मिठो 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 बना बना खुआने थैंक यू सो मच आदिल सर एंड इट वॉज सच ए लवली कन्वर्सेशन एंड थैंक यू फर मेकिंग इट आउट थैंक यू सो मच वहाँ हो एंड एक्टर आदिल हुसैन रहासंग को कन्वर्सेशन तब कस्ट लगे अवश्य मुनि कमेंट बक्स में कमेंट कर नबिर्सिहला ये अन्य इंट्रेस्टिंग पर्सनलिटीज को परिचय लेकर आने अंटिल देन विथ माई कैमरा पर्सन आशीष गुरु दिस इज निर्मल सिंह गुड बाय एंड डू विजिट अस एट डब्लू डब्लू डट डी सिक्किम क्रोनिकल डट कम टेक बाय